Basically, this week is just gonna consist of Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. We don't know about Friday yet, so I'm happy. No, I don't know about Thursday. You don't know about Thursday? Yeah. So it's just more than likely just gonna be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and just like last week, and it was pretty nice actually because Thursday was my Friday and Friday was their Friday. So I mean, I'm happy with that. And then I'll be going to school on Monday because we'll leave Sunday night because <clears throat> they don't have like an after party or anything like they did a couple of years ago. So. Um, I probably have a couple of tests to make up, get all my homework, and stuff like that. It won't be as much as it was, like, Mexico, so I think I'll should, I should be fine. But, um, I think that's it. We'll see, and I'll let you know how school is, and Ellie will be awoke. Awoke? Awoke, and she's going to school too, and she's not excited either. <laughs> I was excited to go back to school when you had like a fun week. Fun you only had two weeks left and then you're on spring break. Yeah, but that's finals week. I haven't took finals in a long When's time. When's finals week? Before? Week before spring break. So right after playlist? Yeah. Oh. oh my gosh, I don't have that much time to make up my work. Nope. Oh my god. Good morning guys, I'm on the way to school and I only have two more days after this because I'm not going to be here Friday. What do you? Wait, why Why am I not going to be here Friday? You got playlist. <laughs> am I going to be there Monday? Yeah, you'll be back Monday. Oh, I'll probably be late. We're just going to Orlando, huh? Orlando again? Ugh. We should have just missed school this week and stayed here in Orlando. I'm excited for playlists. Playlist is fun. Yeah. Have soccer practice today. But my dad says we probably won't because it's gonna rain all day. It's supposed to rain all day. Orlando, like 20 minutes. I was sweeping the garage. Nothing happened. There's a lot of leaves in the garage. I know. Why are there leaves in the garage? So I'm about to go into school. So I will see you guys later. Hi right, guys. Good morning from us in this nice, gloomy, rainy day. I'm so thankful that we came back from the cold, windy Atlanta to enjoy some nice warm weather in Florida. And it was sunny the whole time we were in Atlanta. And it was 80 and 85 and 86 and it was nice and everybody was at the beach. And then we come home to rain. And it's 66 degrees. But you're home. Yep. And, and I slept 66. amazing in my bed. Yeah, you did. <laughs> I took a migraine pill. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <sighs> so, we are currently, we just ate Subway, and we, I didn't blow dry my hair because it's raining and it's just going to get wet anyways, so whatever. Um, we are currently picking up Emma from school. She has cheer practice. Soccer practice will be canceled, obviously. 
because of the rain. So, um, yeah, we were working on uh, YouTube, doing some stuff on our channel and what have you. Um, we have to get ready for playlist. I want to run to the store and everybody get like one nice outfit for the meet and greet on Saturday. So comment below since our comments will be on. Uh, comment below if you're going to playlists and uh, if you'll be in our meet and greet. Uh, Saturday, I think we're group one, I think, um, from 10 to one. So hopefully we get to meet lots of you. Um, we are with Tsunami, which Ellie's super excited about. Um, and actually, so her mom normally doesn't fly. She doesn't like to fly or whatever. So we've never got to meet her mom. We've always just hung out with Tsunami and her dad. And um, uh, her mom's actually coming because you know they have that family channel now. So her um, mom is actually coming this time. So we'll finally get to meet Madre. Um, and then we're with um, Annie Rose is the other person so um, and then the girls also have on Sunday they're doing a not a panel but they call it a panel it's on stage they're doing a challenge game it's a twin challenge where you're in a large oversized t-shirt and I don't know what they're gonna have them do but they have to accomplish that tasks and whoever does first wins and they're with JC and Casey Zoe and Cody Zodi and um, two boys I don't know who the boys are Emma knows who they are I don't know who they are um, but I thought it was kind of cool because Emma's friends with Zoe and uh, JC and Casey and oh Hayden Summerall and another boy that's an Emma um, is not friends with Hayden, but knows of him or whatever. So that'll be fun. And that's, I think, at 11.30 or 12.30. I don't know. I'll have to look and let you know later. So, that's pretty much it. Um, and then the following weekend, are you going to Orlando camp? The weekend after playlist? The one at Disney? Yeah. Problem. Um, the next one's at the ESPN Wide World of Sports or whatever. Um, and then they're on spring break. And then Elizabeth just texted me and said that she can come. So I have to text Jesse's mom and see if Jesse can come. I'm not going to have them come for the whole week. I think I'm going to have them come for like four days five days and then um, have them head home because I'd like to go do s some stuff as well with my kids for spring break so I guess I'm being selfish um, I want to go to wiki uh, wiki watchy Springs and do their um, glass bottom kayaks so hopefully if we have warm weather but they did say that uh, March is going to be colder than February in Florida. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. I don't know. <laughs> global warming. Yeah. Go more like global freezing. I don't know. So we'll see. I'm going to check the calendar. And because Elizabeth has a competition the first week end of their spring break. So she can't come like that weekend. So it only leaves one weekend, which is the last weekend before we go back. And I want that weekend to go do whatever with the girls by ourselves. So I think it's going to be like they're going to leave Sunday and then catch a flight Sunday, I guess. And then be here till Thursday. And then I'll ship them off Thursday or Friday. I don't know. I'll have to look. Hi, guys. I just got home from school and I'm currently making a list of only videos I will be filming. I have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. That covers three weeks. And if I can film these all, well, I actually just need two for this weekend. Um, so that's what I'm doing because video ideas with me is kind of hard because I still can't drive. So, well, 
figure something out. <laughs> and basically, we'll talk about school. So tomorrow I have to stay after school. I have to take a test in psychology. I feel like psychology has the most tests and I don't know why. And then I have a science test tomorrow. And all my grades are up except for two classes, which are the tests that I'm taking tomorrow for it to go up. So I am now good and stress relief. Excuse me. Excuse me. I do you have to your practice today? It's kind of crazy that you just get back from a competition and you have practice, but it's okay. Um, it is NCA week for rain, so that's cool. And then UCA is next, not this weekend, but next weekend for us. What do you want? Stop, I'm not. Ellie. What do you want? You want anything? Just watch him. Mm. Leave me alone. Can I have the remote? So I'm gonna get ready for practice soon. Um, I'm gonna bring some of my homework because it's an hour drive and I get that done and then when I get a home I'm filming a video and then Tomorrow we got to start packing and stuff And I think we should go thrifting Yeah, let me do that two days before we leave for Payless. tomorrow I can get a video too If you think about it double the thing <laughs> what do you want? I don't want anything. Then why are you sitting next to me? Just <laughs> stop, Mark. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ow, you're on my hair. What do you want? I don't want anything. Why? Will you take me to go shopping? When? Tomorrow. No. Why not? I have eighty dollars. Yeah. You're saving it for iPods. iPods. AirPods. <laughs> um, AirPods are like two hundred dollars, and it's gonna take a while to get that, so I'm just gonna spend the eighty dollars because I need it this weekend. What do you need this weekend? I don't have outfits. You have a Tic Tac. A Tic Tac? Yeah. What's a Tic Tac? <laughs> <laughs> I brought my. What do you mean? I don't mean a I stitch. Hi, Digi. Hi, Digi. Where are you going? Oh my gosh. No, you're not coming up. No. No. Psycho. So, anyways, I'm going to get ready for practice and then finish this video blissy thing and then get some of my homework done. <laughs> Okay, so I'm ready for practice. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so I'm ready for practice. I have to wear this, the sublimated outfit, because that's what we wear on Tuesdays. It looks like an hourglass. <laughs> but yeah, and then obviously this bow. This is what we wore to practice on. That practice we had Friday. So honestly, I'm super excited for practice. Haven't like, I'm always excited for practice, but like, you know, I'm kind of dreading to go full out like every time we go to practice. But like, I'm so freaking excited to see everybody, the coaches, hear about our score. Because listen, I have never had a team where we've maxed out in like literally the half the score sheet. Never, ever, ever. Like, maybe I have, I don't re remember, but let me just read this to you. So, like I said, our score was a 98.1. Perfect technique in basket scores, perfect technique in pyramid score, perfect technique in running tumbling score, perfect technique in standing tumbling score. Okay, technique is like the hardest thing if you're just like, I don't know if maybe if you're a cheerleader, maybe it's not for you, but I feel like for me, technique is the hardest thing to max out in and like sort of kind of like our team because obviously day one we were falling and like it was just a big mess and technique was so bad. And if you don't know what technique is, technique is like how like, solid you hit everything and like
drivers and like if your feet are pointed stuff like that so i think i explained that right i just don't really know how to explain it i guess but anyway so i just i'm just freaking excited like i've never been so excited for practice i'm excited to see everyone i'm, I'm excited to see everyone talk to everyone have a good time at practice i'm excited to see cody and coach dom and just like i don't know today's been a really good day and like thinking about practice and i'm so excited for practice thursday too because i'm going to practice thursday before playlist because we only have four practices till our next competition so obviously i want to be there so i'm so freaking excited so i'm actually getting ready to leave savvy's coming in i think 15 minutes she said around five it is 4.45 and we're currently watching Fortnite. <laughs> Hi guys, I just got home and I just cleaned my face up and decided to take my mascara off. Mascara. Off. <laughs> so I just got home from practice and the whole team was not there. I think like half the team was missing because they're like some of the girls are cross computers so they're preparing for this big competition they have this weekend so they're just resting because they have practice as well so we literally just did my elite group was there and we changed the elite a little bit so there's something new in there pyramids a little bit different so i'm super excited to start working on that we literally only have thursday tuesday and thursday for uca and we go against nine teams at uca we perform at 8 10 p.m. on Saturday and then 8.16 on Sunday. I mean, it's better than 9, right? Like, it's an hour difference. So, I mean, hopefully that gives us an advantage. It's basically just like practice if you think about it. So, um, I ate the leftovers my mom gave me from her dinner. So, I ate that for dinner. And then I'm actually getting ready to start some of the homework. Um, I started some of it in, like, practice and stuff, like, on the way there and stuff so we're gonna get that rolling and you're they are currently watching some movie it's like really different i don't know um but I'm basically ready for bed i'll probably be in bed by 11 anyways and tomorrow i'm filming a video in the morning hee <laughs> so that's exciting and then um tomorrow hopefully is a good day it will be Definitely very interesting for many reasons because I have two tests to make up. I have to stay after school and take a test and then get some homework done and pick up my room if I have time because a lot of, I have laundry to put away and stuff and get that done. I just cleaned off my desk. It was filled with candy because of my little what she got me. So I just put it in my desk because I do not really need to be eating candy. I just got done to finish cleaning my room and it looks pretty good. I love the aftermath of cleaning your room. It looks like aesthetically pleasing. I think I said that before. But anyways, okay, so I'm getting ready for bed. I've been getting ready for bed for a while, but I'm going to bed. And I just want to talk about something. I have been on YouTube 24-7, like a couple past days, like looking at video ideas and stuff and watching YouTube videos. And I'm kind of obsessed with like watching Say Yes to the Dress um, like thingies on YouTube. Oh my gosh. I think they're like cool and like, see this one? Bride mom, bride shocked mom with a leather wedding gown. Say Yes to the Dress UK. I don't know, I just think it's really, I just like watching them. They're pretty cool, like seeing what. Ooh, that's one. I want to watch that one. Now. See this? I'm looking at wedding gowns. What the heck? It's so pretty. I also like looking at prom dresses. Prom dresses are fun to look at too. I don't know. I just like the pretty glitz and glams and stuff. I think it's cool. One day. <laughs> so anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And we'll see you guys tomorrow back in another video. Bye, guys.